What happens when you cross the most popular SUV size, class, compact with the luxury segment? The compact luxury crossover SUV, which is easily one of the market's most popular vehicle segments. In the crossover and SUV realm, these upscale family haulers live at an appealing intersection of affordability, city-friendly sizing, and style. Today we take a look at 2023's top-rated compact luxury SUVs available. Starting off with number 3, we have the, the Acura RDX, which strikes a compelling balance between luxury and performance. Motor Trend chose this crossover as a finalist in their SUV of the Year competition because of its agile all-wheel drive handling and spacious, high-quality interior. Driving the crossover in our long-term review fleet for a year, we appreciated its duality. Sporty and fun when we wanted it to be, chill and easy when we didn't. Its excellent driver assistance features were always useful in our daily commutes and road trips. The 2.0-liter i4 engine in the RDX produces 272 horsepower and 280 pound-feet of torque and can accelerate from 0 to 60 in about 6.4 seconds. The front automatic emergency braking system now includes pedestrian detection and has an overall safety rating of 5 stars. Adaptive cruise control and lane keep assist are still included. The Acura RDX has more than just advantages. Several disadvantages include complaints about rough shifting while driving. If you've ever driven a Mercedes, you'll recognize the jerk shifting. Also, the infotainment system seems to be lacking when you compare it to the next compact SUV on our list. Genesis and its GV70 take second place in our list of the best luxury compact SUVs. The GV70 is an excellent SUV, and for the time being, the second best vehicle in its class. The compact Genesis was comfortable and engaging on any road surface during last year's SUV of the year motor trend evaluations, with athletic handling that didn't come at the expense of ride quality. Even if you're not the type of buyer who drives it through twisty roads, it's a joy to drive. Base models are powered by a 2.5-liter turbocharged i4 that produces 300 horsepower and 311 pound-feet of torque and propels the GV 70 to 60 miles per hour in 6.0 seconds in our testing. The four fuel cylinders economy is 2228 Snook City slash highway. Genesis hit the ball out of the park with this one. Sure, the brakes can be a little grabby at times, and the fuel economy isn't the best in the segment, but as a package, this is a product that any prospective luxury SUV buyer would be foolish to overlook. The Tesla Model Y is, of course, the final and best SUV on our list. This is a seriously fast vehicle, with near-instant responses and steering resembling a sports car, but with a supreme luxury twist. These handling characteristics were crucial in the Model Y's victory over the Ford Mustang Mach-E in our recent comparison. The Model Y performance, with its staggered wheels, larger brakes, and lowered suspension, only improves the dynamics. Tesla offers two Model Y variants, Long Range and Performance, both of which feature a dual-motor all-wheel drive powertrain. A 75 kilowatts battery powers both models. We tested a Model Y Long Range, and it hit 60 miles per hour in 4.1 seconds. Tesla claims that the performance model will complete the sprint in 3.5 seconds. The Model Y shares a 15.0-inch touchscreen infotainment display with the rest of Tesla's lineup. The infotainment system integrates nearly every control for the compact SUV, which has a significant learning curve if you're coming from a non-Tesla vehicle. Because Tesla does not support Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, you'll have to rely on the system's navigation and media apps. As a final thought, it's difficult to go wrong when choosing between the Model Y Long Range and the Model Y Performance. The decision is based on your priorities, but if you have the money, we'd recommend the faster performance model because there isn't much of a range sacrifice. We hope you enjoyed this super quick and informative video. Thanks for your time and we will see you on the next one.